Hi guys, Tim here doing another military review and this time it's on a British First World War Royal Flying Corps reconnaissance slash officers um, military compass actually used in the First World War. Now the, this compass is all Bakelite and even has the original strap and leather casing still there, still intact. So let's go on. Open this up. Ah, just open this up. Firstly, you've got the instruction manual for instructing you on how to use it because nobody's ever used a compass before. But yeah, if you can open this up, which takes about three weeks to open, it has it in multiple languages French, German, uh, French, I think, and British. And it says along here instruction for use of prismic compass for with adjustable direction which is a direct direct directional adjustment and next thing here if I can actually get out get the oh sorry I'll get the compass out okay here of course is a little me screwdriver of course I'm doing the little middly bits on the compass and here it is, the compass. Now this is standard British compass during the First World War. I'm going to date it around 1916, uh, around about 1916, early 1917 I'll date it to. And which I will splice in a picture of a, this, a compass being used in the First World War. Um, so yes, as you can see there. compass, so it moved around, sorry about the light, being moved around there, and if you, and it's all Bakelite, which is an old form, which is the old version of plastic invented in 1907, in Germany actually, so, we up here, and yes, all still works, everything still works, I just, uh, everything still works on that. So yeah, as you can see, it, it will spin around a little like a normal compass does, which I will splice in a picture of a nap, what a compass would look like. Well, now, nowadays compass. Now this little thing here is actually a magnifying glass, which doesn't uh, work that way. Well now, it's just to magnify the little niddly bits numbers around the sides down there but yeah so how you work compass is of course you get the you get the map say north is up there so no say say north is that way you put your compass on there then you set the there's a little I'll use the screwdriver there's a little n for north where's it gone there which you probably can't see but there's an n for north right there so basically what you turn so you turn the north to the the um <coughs> pardon me to the top of the compass here the top of the map sorry here then you just pick it up knowing in the direction you wanted to go then you just go in that direction and it's simple as that see that's just been a basic lesson on how to use a compass and that has been my review on this First World War compass. See ya, bye.